to Italy. We're going to Rome. Oh, listen. Do I really need three pairs of boots? I, <laughs> I arrived looking disheveled. Fenty glow, obviously. You wanted your face to be dry as possible, as much as possible. Missy, are you gonna help me pack? Hey YouTube fam, it's Shella, as you saw from the title. Me and Joe are going to Italy. We're going to Rome. We're really excited because it's the first time we're actually traveling anywhere outside of the UK and actually getting on a plane since 2019. We're really excited for this trip. Planned it for his birthday. His birthday is January 11th. We're going tomorrow until the 12th, so for four nights. Um, a nice hotel booked and everything, and we're just so excited, so yeah. I thought we could pack together. I don't even know where to begin because I don't remember the last time I actually, well actually yeah, 2019 was the last time I packed for an actual like whole holiday trip away overseas. We went and got this suitcase from TK Maxx literally today. We're running around trying to find a suitcase, trying to just get last bits and bobs. We are still in need of finding a UK to Europe plug adapter. So I feel like we're gonna have to get some bits and bobs at the airport which is going to cost a fortune, but hey-ho. But yeah, let's get packing. I don't really know. I'm not a master packer. I'm not really the best at packing. I'm just like, if it fits, it sits. So if you want organization tips, I am not your girl. I'm just go with the flow and hope for the best kind of girl. You know, where do I start? Maybe start with shoes because they take up the most space. I'm going to start with shoes. Also, if the background is a mess, don't judge, okay? We were faffing around. Missy, what shoes should I pack? So I'm thinking of packing these really cute boots for like a more fancy night out and they're a thick heel. We love a thick heel because they're more comfortable. <laughs> fancy boots and then a pair of casual stylish boots. I'm thinking my Doc Martens, you can't go wrong with them. Missy, no, I'm not packing you. But yeah, if you're wondering where my cat's going to be, we've booked her a little mini holiday. <laughs> um, she's staying at a cattery. I read a dozen reviews to make sure that they're not just like shoved in a shed kind of thing and that she will be looked after with lots of love and attention having her own little city holiday shall we say so i'm thinking these boots or these boots i really have no idea how best to pack shoes do you do it like this and then i guess this can go here do i really need three pairs of boots i it's only four nights okay I think the docks. The docks are more comfy. The weather is going to be not super cold. It's kind of similar weather to here. A little bit breezy. I think it's in like highs of 16, 17 degrees with like light showers. So the weather isn't crazy. It's manageable. It can still look cute and not have to throw in a massive winter coat. We just didn't expect it to come by so close. Like we really thought we had a lot more time to prepare. And then we were like, oh shit, we go in like a couple of days. Oh shit, we go tomorrow. <laughs> Boots, shoes. Done. Trousers. Bottoms. Okay. I'm thinking I love these leather trousers. These chocolate brown leather trousers. They're like straight leg. Super stylish. My aim is to be stylish but comfortable because we're going to be doing a lot of walking, you know, a lot of getting around. So the aim is comfort. And then I've got these like Levi's um, utility trousers, jeans. They're like a really baggy fit, really comfortable and I just think they look really cool. So I thought these would look really cool with... <gasps> Oh, I should pack my dunks. Yes. Oh, okay. I keep forgetting I got these. Orange and brown night dunks. I think they're so cool. So we've got two pairs of trousers. I've got a pair of black jeans in the wash. So a pair of black jeans, leather trousers, baggy trousers. So we've got like smart trousers, smart size trousers. We've got cool trousers and then we've got basic trousers. Tomorrow, my airport wear is going to be joggers. Listen, I really give massive props to those that actually that wear heels to the airport. They get fully dressed up for the airport and like have an, a whole entire fit. I actually give props because me, <laughs> I arrive looking disheveled. I arrive looking like I've been dragged through a bush because I just want pure comfort. Okay, that's my motto in life is comfort. I also need some clothes for like a fancy night. So when we go for like a fancy dinner, especially for his birthday. So, ah! They just saw that on camera. This is abuse. Human abuse. Fancy clothes. Leave my ankle alone. Go away. Ah, Missy. Get off. Also, I didn't realize I have so many things in brown. Just a lot of brown colored things. So, I was thinking this. I'm, I love this. It's just so basic. It's just a, a high neck and high neck brown long sleeve. I thought this would go nicely with literally Really any of the trousers I wear. 
Also, don't judge my folding skills, okay? Don't come for me. Put this top here. And then I have these black shorts, these um, black cycling shorts. So I'm thinking of doing an all black night for dinner, for like one of the dinners. These black cycling shorts and then this black silk top on top with a pair of black boots. Yeah, my whole wardrobe is just brown. Yeah, brown. <laughs> Got my makeup brushes. Wow, this is a... This palette from Zoeva. I'm... This is literally my everyday... I say every day, but when I do wear makeup, there's my go-to palette. So definitely taking that. Don't judge my drawer, okay? I've got my NARS foundation. I don't know what I'm packing. I'm going to take these two concealers because I think this one's still a bit, a little bit too orange for me. And then this one's too pale, so I guess that will mix perfectly. Fenty Glow, obviously. And then obviously, my Fenty Highlighter. I got it in Go Next Door and... Oh, it's a kilowatt. Don't judge this drawer, okay? It's an organized mess. Oh, <gasps> I found her. Okay, I'm definitely bringing this. It's an Anastasia Beverly Hills Blush Trio in Peachy Love. It is just divine shades of peach. Mm. I'm a lip gloss and lip liner kind of girl, okay. And this is the Morphe Sweet Tea. I think this is like one of their most popular shades versatile brown it's like a dark brown but not too dark so that is perfect bringing that i think i'm also going to bring this blush it's more of a a darker mauve kind of shade eyebrows where's my eyebrow pencil oh my god i just i need to stop chucking everything in there's my eyebrow pencil oh my god i found it falling down <laughs> okay i think makeup is done that should be... Oh, wait. Actually. Missy! Then I'm going to pack this lip liner as well. It's in the shade um, Backseat Love by Morphe. A little bit more of like a pinky kind of shade. I think that's makeup done. Setting spray. This is the Too Faced Hangover 3-in-1. I love this setting spray. It has like a really nice peachy smell as well. It gives more of a dewy finish rather than like a matte finish. Isn't it funny? Like back in the day, I wanted my face to look as dry as possible. Like that was a thing back in the day. I think that was a universal thing. Like when you're like a t in your teen time, you wanted your face to be dry as possible, as matte as possible. No hydration look, no dew, no glow, nothing. And now every time I wear makeup, I want a dewy finish. I want to be glowing from within, but also from the outside. <laughs> Oh my god, where is it? Yeah. You guys know already how much I love this fucking palette. The Sweet Peach Glow by Too Faced. This, when in doubt, this is my holy grail. Two pairs of boots, casual boots and fancy boots. Dunks. Okay, we got shoes, we got washing. Skincare and wash bag is going to be last because we're going to use those, you know, those things tonight. What else is one pack? I've got my makeup. Am I ready? Am I packed? Joe. I don't know, is that everything packed? Shoes, clothes. We've got a um, toiletry bag, haven't we? Yeah, so toiletries. Well, we're not, we still need to use them tonight. Okay, suitcase is pretty much packed. Joe put a pizza in and he burnt it, so takeout it is. All that's left, and I think we're gonna have to most likely get it at the airport last resort, is plug adapters, and that's it. Okay. Headphones, they've still got quite a fair amount of charge on them. I mean, the journey really and truly is only like two and a half hours, something like that. So it's a quick journey. I'm going to pack a book. I'm going to pack my my 5am club book. So that will go in there. Passports are in there. I'm going to put them in the little inside mini pocket. There's not really too much going on here. My laptop, I'm going to pack my laptop as well, but that's in use at the moment. And then I think that is it. Okay, I think that's it. We are 99% packed. We've just got some last bits and bobs left to do later on, but they're still currently in use or going to be used tonight. But yeah, we've got the main important thing, the passports, my clothes, makeup, all the more, I guess, big things. And yeah, I'm really excited. Um, I definitely recommend following me on... Oh, that's my laundry. Definitely recommend following me on Instagram, my underscore Shella Hernandez for more everyday posts so you can really keep up to date with me if you like. Otherwise, if not, that's fine. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm packing with me. Have a little chit chat. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.